Kelly D. So have you ever had afternoon tea? If you have, one of the features of a great afternoon tea are the sandwiches. Now, many, many years ago, while I was a teenager, my first job was to work at a hotel, one of the top hotels in Barbados. And one feature at this hotel was to serve afternoon tea. And I absolutely love this part because they always had a variety of sandwiches. Now today I'm gonna to recreate an afternoon tea party for you as we make three types of sandwiches. So let's go over the ingredients. We have some sliced bread, some white and some bran. The bran bread gives additional fiber, so it's really good for you. But we are gonna use the two types just for variety. Now our first sandwich will be cucumber sandwiches this these are so refreshing i would have sliced the cucumber thinly then sprinkled it with some salt we have mayonnaise to make our paste we have two hard boiled eggs for our second sandwich which will be the egg sandwiches we have the half of a lime squeeze for our paste and our third sandwich will be tuna sandwiches. So we have some tuna fish, we have sweet pepper chopped and onion chopped. We have salt and pepper to balance everything out. We are gonna use one ounce of cream cheese and parsley. Our first step is to prepare our tuna paste. For a sandwich, so we're gonna put a pinch of black pepper and a pinch of salt. We're gonna add our mayonnaise and then we're gonna mix everything together. And once this is completely mixed, this will complete the first paste for our sandwiches. We'll touch is some lime juice. Now this, a sprig of parsley. Now this is ready. Next sandwich to make will be our egg sandwich. So I'm gonna use a box grater. We're gonna use the side that has the largest holes and we are going to grate our hard boiled eggs. Then I'll show you the next step. Now that our eggs are fully grated, we're gonna add once again, some parsley we're going to add some salt and pepper and then we're going to add the mayonnaise to create our second piece once this is fully mixed paste number two will be ready our last sandwich is to get our cream cheese you know so i would have removed as much of it as we can we're just using like one ounce of our cream cheese. Try to get it at room temperature so it would be able to paste easily. We're gonna get a bit of our parsley to help to bring a savory aspect to our cream cheese. And once again, I'm gonna get my box grater, but this time I'm gonna use one of the smaller sides and I'm gonna just get some orange zest which is the skin the rind of the orange so i'm going to grate a bit of it on the smaller side just to get some of that orange zest the box grater is a great tool it has so many sides and it does so many functions in the kitchen so if you don't have yourself a box grater you should get one it is multi-functional Now I'm gonna mix everything together. Our parsley, our cream cheese, and our zest. This completes the paste. Now we'll put our sandwiches together to form our tea party. Now it's time to lay our sandwiches out.
are done. Cucumber, egg, and tuna. Now it's time to taste. I think I'm gonna try the egg sandwich. Mm. So delicious. It totally transports me back to my days of working in the hotel as a teenager when we served lots of guests from the UK with afternoon tea sandwiches. There are so many varieties that you can also add to make this a sandwich party that you will like. Afternoon tea sandwiches? Now you have to try it. Now, if you enjoyed this afternoon tea sandwich video, I want you to look over here and see some of my other videos. And once you've watched them all, just click the button below, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I post a video. And remember to leave me a comment. I love hearing from you. Thank <laughs> you.